This is Duke University. The exhibition is a look at the record or albums in contemporary art over the last 50 years. And the idea is to look at the way that artists have looked at it as a transformative medium, have used it as a metaphor to discuss numerous topics, and have really never abandoned it even through the shift from the analog to the digital era. The exhibition opened the last Wednesday of August with a big DJ party and broad community representation. Uh, it was a great opportunity for them to interact with the artists. We've had about seven artists and catalog contributors here and gallerists and people who've really helped make the whole project come together. And then from the community there also were people who have never set foot in the museum before and for us that's a real triumph. Painting like record covers uh, just gives like a more modern feel to something that we think of as sort of ancient <laughs> even though it's not that old. It's so much more interesting like the feel to it. You kind of lose that with the like with your iPods and stuff. That, that music used to be things, and now it's just files on a computer. Many installations combine audio, visual, and interactive elements. It's essentially um, a studio album um, that I've been recording, and it's also a color field painting, and it's also a sculpture. If I wasn't doing an art exhibition with it, I would have loved to have pressed it on vinyl. Well, I've made a number of uh, artist friends since uh, this show, and there's a Again, as I say, a cross-pollination of, uh, of me feeding off uh, ideas that I'm getting from them. From an art historical perspective, you have works in here that are um, from artists who have been working with the subject for 30 or even more years. So, or for artists like Jasper Johns or Ed Ruscha or even Carrie Mae Weems, we're looking at art works of theirs that um, are little known, that we're, we've sort of uncovered, like when you're digging through records and you find that hidden gem that you didn't really, you weren't necessarily looking for when you went into the store. The record exhibition continues at the Nasher Museum until February 6, 2011. Produced by Duke University. Online at duke.edu.